Hey guys, this is Sharon here at IDEB Hockey. Gonna take a quick look at the Easton Mako stick. Starting at the top of the stick, we'll be going over the dimensions. It is a more traditional dimension. It does have the straight sidewalls with the rounded corners. This is also a more pro-inspired feel. Moving down the shaft, this shaft is wrapped in a ballistic woven Kevlar. It does help provide the vibration dampening and also improves the puck feel as well. This will also protect the stick from slashes and those heavy shots. Moving down, we will see it tapers off a little bit. This will provide the low kick point, and which will give you the preloads for the quick snapshots and the wrist shots. Moving down to the blade, it is a 3K woven carbon. This also has a solid dense lower core, which will help keep the blade in contact with the puck longer, resulting in great puck feel and those good shots. And it also does have this non-skid coating. It does uh, help provide great puck feel and it will help keep the puck on the blade where the tape is not and also will help the tape stick better for a tighter wrap on the blade. Now going over the feel of the stick, it is going to have that nice lightweight balanced feel to this stick. It is a little more blade heavier than the S19, but with that being said, it is a top of the end stick so you're going to get that great balance and feel to it. Now looking at the graphics, it does have a nice matte gray and matte white finish on this might help you uh, trick the goalies. Once again, thank you for taking a look at the new Easton Mako stick. You can get this at inline and icewarehouse.com.